Hey guys, before the video gets started, I wanted to mention that I have a giveaway going on, and I talked about it in a video, and if you didn't see it, you can go check it out now. I talked about hitting 500 subscribers and a giveaway, so if you guys want to go enter that giveaway, go check out that video, and I will be giving away a $50 GameStop gift card. Now, to the video. Hey guys, that's the boy Karen, so I'm with another video, and I'm doing a video on the stained uh, glass mod. So, this mod adds stained glass, and uh, I'm in an app called Modded PE, and this has been a while for like a couple months now or something. And, uh, doing a video on it has been around that long. Uh, maybe it has, and I just don't remember. Uh, but, as you can see, uh, it looks like, you know, the PC home screen or home, like, for the launcher and stuff. You can press play and stuff. But if we tap this, that shows what was just up there. It's just out that by pressing X and stuff. Got, like, settings that you can tap uh, to show different things on here and stuff, like, Safe mode, redstone dot, high debug text, and all that stuff. Then manage the stuff. And as you can see, I got the stained glass thing, so I'll play it now. Then got the home page. As you can see, it will update to the picture. And you got it right there. So it's at stained glass in Minecraft Pocket Edition. So it's uh, press play and it's just out. So it's loading up. See, so yeah, the thing for it looks like. Uh, the home page for the computer and stuff, but yeah, I as the default stuff right now. Okay, so I changed my skin and you know renamed my character to my uh, thing I go by. But yeah, I'm gonna go create a new world for this, and I'll be right back once I've created the world. Okay, so I loaded up a world, a flat world, and I'm gonna show off this mod. I'll actually, uh. Do it right over here, and uh, if we go into the inventory, we can go to this, like, bookshelf tab, and uh, go down, and uh, here is all the stained glass. It also affects beacons, like you probably saw in that picture earlier, so I'm going to get out some uh, stained glass, and also get out some uh, iron blocks, so I can make a, a beacon, so let me just uh, put it over here, but I actually also have to get out the beacon thing okay there we go and uh yeah so i'm going to just build a beacon real quick and uh, get this finished okay so i have a beacon right here and as you can see this is what happens when you build a beacon uh but we got this like different stained glass and i can change different colors with it so you gotta crouch and boom uh you know that's why it won't affect anything but as you can see, this is orange, and uh, it makes it orange and stuff, which is cool. And then if we put magenta, changes to magenta, same with light blue, it looks all light blue now. As you can see right there, um, actually just gonna leave it on right there. And uh, yeah, so it can be like a bunch of different colors that you can use for this. And uh, you know, stained glass, it's glass, but like stained and stuff can make different colors. Uh, we don't have it in Pocket Edition yet, uh, but soon it might come, uh, since, you know, we, uh, there's been, like, some, uh, issues with stained glass in this, because of certain things, but, uh, as you can see, I'm just gonna go lay out some of this stained glass, and, uh, yeah, so there's, uh, different colors we got, like, uh, there is on PC and uh, console, I think, as well. And, uh, yeah, so we got all these different colors, and I can try the different uh, colors right on the beacons if I just make a few of these. Okay, so I made a, a couple of these so far. Uh, as the white one, you know, doesn't really do anything, uh, but orange, you saw, does some things magenta and stuff and uh yellow let's see what it all 
change colors. As you can see, it's like a yellow and that, uh, you know, outer blue things like all green now and stuff. And you gotta crouch when you uh, put them on there, or else you'll go into the beacon yourself. And uh, like I just did right there, you gotta remember to crouch and then go into it because I've done that accidentally a few times. And we can also get out some other colors for this beacon. Uh, so let's get out like this one and see if we can actually just fit in these last few colors right here. It doesn't look like it, but yeah, we got a bunch of different colors that you can pick from. And it all affects the beacons at stained glass. You can more decorate and stuff. And it is a mod, so you will have to have a separate app to be able to use this uh, mod. And I'll put the download link in the description below so you guys can download this mod for yourselves and mess around with it and stuff. You just need the, you need the modded PE app and you'll be able to check out this uh, mod which adds in different stained glass. Which is awesome uh, because, you know, we don't have stained glass yet because of functioning issues and other reasons but uh can also add uh, more colors to like this over here so got like light gray and cyan and stuff so uh yeah now let's see what the gray one looks like up here as you can see it's what the gray one looks like then we got the light gray and it makes it like a bit darker for that one got the cyan which makes it all cyan and stuff which is cool so yeah, that's some of the different colors that you got in this mod for this. So it's a cool mod and, uh, you know, adds uh, stained glass. And uh, that's just awesome. So download the link will be in the description below. And if you don't know about this mod PE app, like I said, it hasn't been long, around that long, like 2016 to this year. I don't know when in 2016. But you can also try different mods with this uh uh, app it doesn't have to be just you know stained glass and stuff uh, but uh, I'm just showing off the stained glass mod and uh, yeah so that will be it, it for this video and if you guys liked the video then leave like and if you're new here hit that subscribe button and as always guys I'll see you in the next video bye